works 12 hour rotating shifts, seven days a week, and they have long days and long nights each and every day. There's a very strong can-do attitude. Everyone knows each other and helps each other out. Ensuring everybody goes home safe and healthy at the end of the day is number one. At Long Lake, we have approximately 200 to 250 people, from operators to maintenance uh, tradespeople, engineers, safety professionals, and administrative professionals. We're all a very tight bunch and all sorts of levels of experience. We've got people like myself who are 10 years and under in the trade, and then we've got people as well as 40 years experience in the trade, so we do take a lot from each other. I come from, from China, and there are uh, also some people coming from different countries around the world. So they have a different background, so we get a lot of uh, good ideas, so we can try them one by one try to solve a problem. The Long Lake layout really focuses on the central processing facility, which is the main plant. Around that plant, we have the, the well pads. For getting the oil out of the ground, we use high pressure steam to heat up the bitumen and then we uh, return that bitumen and water mixture back into the facility for further treatment. The oil goes off to our uh, customers through pipeline, and then the water gets treated again so that we can uh, make steam and then re-inject that steam back down into the reservoir to get more bitumen. A typical day, team members will attend a toolbox uh, meeting first thing in the morning, and they'll go over the day's plans as well as any safety topics, um, and then they will get out and go do their first rounds of work. Our supervisor will hand out our packages for our work for the day. We take those packages, we meet up with operations, and we do walk-downs on those jobs. Production and maintenance work together to maintain the equipment. Um, it's a delicate balance between shutting equipment down and keeping it reliable and operational. So coordination between these groups is, is key to that success. On the top of that, we have to look after the safety because uh, safety is fundamental for Long Lake operation. Safety is always your highest priority. It's your number one. You go into every job with safety first. The next milestone during the day is our, our daily production meeting. All of the leaders come in and, and talk about the, the daily production plan. And then uh, throughout the rest of the day, we focus on execution, allowing people to get that work done and, and make things happen. And at the end of the day, the day shift team that's going home will do a shift change with the night shift team that's coming to start the process all over again. I think the biggest challenge working in Long Lake will be the weather because in winter it's extremely cold. We have several months uh, where we can be minus 20, uh, to minus 40, minus 45. Imagine being bundled up in your parka and snow pants and snow boots uh, for a 12 hour shift, walking around in the snow and the ice. So we spend a lot of time making sure that our people are uh, aware of the risks. Uh, but it's definitely a challenge working in this region in the, in the wintertime. One of the things I appreciate most about working at Long Lake is, is the teamwork, the, the common goal, everyone pulling together and, and striving to make this, this place work and profitable. And also the people are very friendly, very open. For me, you know, I'm proud of the part of the team. I think the future for Long Lake is uh, very bright. We think that the way we've executed projects, especially around our safety record and our compliance, demonstrates world-class operation, and we're looking forward to taking on more and more projects in the future.